Gamesflix was a DVD by mail subscription service offering flat rate rental of home videos and video games to customers in the United States. On September 6, 2007, the company did a 1 to 1000 reverse split of its stock and changed its ticker symbol from GZFX to GMZN. The company's home page went dark in November 2008. Gamesflix operated in much the same fashion as other DVD by mail subscription services such as Netflix, although it rented both movies and video games and thus also competed with game only services such as Gamefly. Subscribers could also buy selected DVDs or games at a reduced price, should they choose to keep the movie or game. Gamesflix also acted as a traditional online retailer and offered new copies of DVDs and video games for sale. Circuit City, now defunct, offered one-month prepaid subscriptions of Gamesflix for new customers and gift certificates that could be sent to friends and family. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Rental offerings and memberships. Gamesflix offered online rental of video games for the PlayStation, PlayStation 2, Xbox, GameCube, Xbox 360, PlayStation 3, and Wii and movies in DVD, HD DVD, and Blu-ray disc formats. They did not offer cartridge-based gaming formats such as those used for the Game Boy Advance and Nintendo DS. Gamesflix offered three monthly subscription plans, which allowed the customer one, two, or three video games or movies at a time. All plans were of the unlimited variety, 14-day free trials of most of the plans were available with a restricted selection of titles. Members of the U.S. military received discounted pricing roughly 10 off on these plans, and Gamesflix shipped to foreign military bases through the APO, FPO military mail service. Financials <laughs> 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 According to the last available SEC filings, Gamesflix discontinued operations in the video rental business in November 2008. The filing states that the company will look for other business ventures to be acquired. The company had net losses of $1.1 million on revenue of $931,000 in 2008 versus losses of over $10 million on revenue of $3.6 million in 2007. Distribution centers According to the Gamesflix 2007 annual report, the company used warehouses in Colorado and Kentucky to service its customers. Marketing From February 2004 through the 2005 Super Bowl Gamesflix maintained a television advertisement campaign, some of which featured the actor Ben Curtis best known as the Dell Dude in advertisements for Dell, Inc. A pilot marketing program with electronics retailer Circuit City from November 2005 to March 2006 was extended to a full co-marketing agreement with all U.S. stores offering prepaid subscriptions and other promotional efforts by Circuit City flyers, online, etc. All stores were participating as of December 2006. Throughout 2006, Gamesflix sponsored of a bicycle racing team in and around Tennessee and several watercraft competitions throughout the United States. They increased Internet advertising with Internet service providers and started an affiliate program. They also teamed up with McDonald's and Clickcaster in a cross-country series of promotional events featuring tour buses, Ridge Racer 6 gaming competitions, outdoor movie showings, and other activities. Other tie-ins included Circuit City stores, Clickcaster broadcasts from on-site locations, and contributions to the Ronald McDonald House and other local charities. Legal proceedings From the Gamesflix 2008 Annual Report, Item 3. Legal Proceedings On February 8, 2008, an action was filed in the United States District Court, Western District of Pennsylvania, entitled Mobile Satellite Communications v. Gamesflix, Inc. et al. In this action, the plaintiff claims that it was damaged as a result of the termination of the agreement covering leased television channels by GNF Entertainment, LLC. 
A judgment in the amount of $350,000 has been rendered to the plaintiff. On February 28, 2008, an action was filed in the Simpson Circuit Court, Franklin, Kentucky, entitled CNET Networks, Inc. v. Gamesflix, Inc., D. B. A. Gamesflix.com. In this action, the plaintiff claims that it was damaged as a result of not being paid for online advertising requested by Gamesflix, Inc. in the amount of $96,000. A judgment in the amount of $67,038 has been rendered to the plaintiff. On July 17, 2008, an action was filed in Simpson Circuit Court, Franklin, Kentucky, entitled Ingram Entertainment, Inc. v. John Fleming D. B. A. Gamesflix, Inc. In this action, the plaintiff claims that it was damaged as a result of not being paid for purchases made in 2007 in the amount of $45,040. A judgment in the amount of $45,940 plus interest until settled was rendered on November 24, 2008. Name change Eight months after shutting down its DVD and game rental website without notice to customers, Gamesflix announced that it has changed its corporate name to TBC Global News Network, Inc. and their stock trading symbol to TGLN. The change is to reflect a change in its business model from online video rental to become a media organization concentrating on news and information about the second and third tier of American business. Gamesflix CEO John Fleming states between CNBC, Fox Business Network, and Bloomberg, the market is pretty well saturated with information about Fortune 500 companies. We intend to focus on the companies you rarely hear about, those trading on the Nasdaq Small Cap, OTCBB, Pink Sheets and some interesting privately held firms that aren't publicly traded at all. In October 2015, the company changed its name once again to Incapta Inc. Stock symbol INCT.